Hey Aquarius, welcome back to my place. I see Shell speaks messages. Gypsy Witch Tarot. Sending you love all the way from India, Bharat. Namaste. Let's start with the read and just to mention that I'm still like recovering. So you may feel the change in a little bit of throat or speech in the mid as well. Thank you for wishing me well to, to get well soon. Thank you. <clears throat> okay. It's all about underneath or beneath. People will be here asking questions and they find answers in the most possible inappropriate way. I mean, I don't know with whom it's going to go or pertain. I feel like some of you are seeking answers around certain kind of connection or relationship here. Someone who may be bringing some kind of uh, softness or messages, but they feel off to you, possible. Something is off around emotions, possible. Okay, we're going to dig deep what is coming. Also, I have my store on my channel. Also, <clears throat> I have membership live. You can join there. There are special readings. Those are not available on YouTube. It's around relationship. It's around question around your relationship. Now, this relationship sector may go as in like, maybe your status is about just like knowing each other. Maybe it is about you people are engaged. It depends, okay? Or maybe you're married, but there is something going around this four of home kind of energy, which is like four of wands kind of energy, okay? I don't know what is going around here right now, but as if like the wands are shifting, like the pillars are shifting, okay? Someone is playing corner, corner kind of, you know, like there's a room and there are four corners in the room uh, in an appropriate way. It's not weird. It's okay. It's usual. It's okay. It feels normal. Okay. This is supposed to be happening, but then you feel something is standing in the corner or some, some feeling is standing in the corner, not in a creepy way. It means that you need to ask about oh, what's going on there. Okay. Someone is asking questions. Oh, what was that? Who is that? Okay, maybe it's someone you do not trust as your as your person, like partner or someone. They have a friend and you were asking that something is inappropriate. What is that? Who is that? Who is she? Who is he? Kind of questions are there around your connection. I, I feel like that kind of energy. Or if it is just the phase of like uh, you don't live together, but then there, uh, there are questions like why your phone was busy? Like what is that? Or who is she? Okay, that is something that's happening. Maybe this is for some of you, but there is, this is, this is some, for some of you, this could be difficult as of like, yes, some, someone is hiding something here. Okay. Now you people are going to narrow down the search, narrow down your, you know, like you're holding a magnifying glass. For example, you want to be clear before you sp speak or ask your person here. Okay. Uh, in this situation, you people are... <clears throat> narrowing down the like options the situation or something is there which is maybe it's heavy and you, if if this is all in the starting of knowing someone you have this phase of like the more i talk the more i talk i will know the reality means their their, their their feelings okay do they just talk talk because there is this energy who may be talking talking just okay and it doesn't make sense because this this has to be like understanding zone which i don't see here for some of you uh, so you're not going to step in. You're not going to step in what they're trying to do. Okay. Two of Cups. Is it like all the times Two of Cups is good, nice? No. Sometimes this can be creepy. Who is trying to wander off and then trying to come back? Who is trying to... Should you stay or should you go? Should I stay or should I go? If I'm not wrong with words, okay. Um, I heard the word valuable. For some of you, this is going to be valuable lesson. Ace of Swords is all about <clears throat> the breakthrough, yes. The truth be told kind of situation, yes. Um, but it's also someone who's going to initiate the conversation with you. Now you have all the rights to whether to step in this or not. Means you can hear, you can text, you can talk if you, it is comfortable for you. But this is a big matter for you. 
is it like turning into something is it like you're ready for this because there are questions around something and i cannot exaggerate on this more there is something around commitment someone is going to make the move here now thing is that if they come around and they talk about something and this may be exciting okay someone may end up saying i love you but do you feel the same or are you ready or do you do you have questions around that i feel like you have questions around that i mean yes it is exciting there is a rival this feels good i don't know why i feel like someone might be around you who may come around when they want like you know la 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 la, la. and they end things so abruptly like you know so it's not always it's not always dreamy you know some this is about you you're waking up from the dream okay which is good for your life okay it's a clear talk it's a clear talk it it is what it is what's on your mind you're going to talk through some of you are going to for your own answers for your own security and protection and concern you're going to ask what is supposed to be asked around this relationship or connection you have all the rights to know however this can go as a versa but you have all the rights to know you have this you may be dealing with someone if you're dealing you're talking someone over here is already married or they were means they may be coming out of the processes on of separation or divorce now this may not be for all okay but yes if this is something that i am connecting and it's around that relationship or <clears throat> connection oh yes you're supposed to be knowing because you don't want to disappoint you don't want to break someone's home if the reality is different if the process is all about separation and all then again you have all the rights to know about what is this what is this you're going to ask these are questions what is this and this is around a loving connection a love connection or a romantic connection or the relationship okay the lovers or could be simple as lovers are these lovers are we do you really feel that we are something is going to change the status of your connection or situation around your connection when you will talk this is the reality this is a breakthrough when you ask questions things change breaking free may get disappointing answers or not the the things that you want or you wish the the lovers <clears throat> some of you are dealing with an like someone is third involvement in your current relationship as well and still not out it's still not out and i'm feeling thirsty again and again maybe it's because i'm recovering here i don't know the thirst is all about it's maybe it's about the thirst it's about the thirst and don't take it in a creepy way it means the thirst that never is comfortable it means you're not you you always feel thirsty around emotions because they are not giving you appropriate answers so if this is about your marriage okay they are not giving you answers so if someone is talking to your partner and you are not dealing with anyone you have all the rights to ask questions if uh, yes all i can say is that right now it's around your now connection it's around your relationship it's around your marriage so i i say like this is as per your timelines right so this is your connection whether it's marriage whether it's living whether it's like you're engaged or dating i can also say that there is some move that is going to happen <clears throat> specific in your life after either you are done with the breakthrough after you are done with the uh, thorough something like here yes about your current relationship how sincere it is or serious it is this is about reality versus what we talk it's about reality check it's a big reality check here
the way someone is going to make the move okay and uh, I did one of the readings just before this it's connected with they're about to make the move okay so it depends on person to person what is going on this is also about someone who doesn't want to be where they, they are or the process is all about separation and everything I said so experience healing and all that so this is about making a wise decision or choice this is something that is coming okay you cannot just go on if the circle is open you you just can't do and you shouldn't get involved even okay you should never get involved with someone who's married a married man or a married woman okay do not because it's it's <clears throat> this comes as in like encrypted okay and this is something that they have to resolve you cannot help them okay you're just having a they are putting you as a backup plan if this fits you okay so you are so if this is something that is like already done and the process is on 11 11 recording time this is what is happening if if this is about different sector in your life you're having a here a fresh start there is someone could be in your friend group common mutual friends okay maybe connected with a community here kindred spirits you know like-minded energies here uh, maybe you're connecting with them online there's a group something a page or something like that you're going to connect with them you're going to talk the next move is all about you're going to meet this person at least they want to meet you <clears throat> Let's see what is coming. I, I feel like, I feel like this is a whole different thing here. And here it is different. As if like someone is changing the water from this particular jar or pot to the other pot. what I heard someone is living in Mauritius this is very creepy I never said that like uh, someone who is living in Mauritius I heard that maybe some of you might be listening to me from that place the dream The dream or dreams will catch up with you. I mean, maybe it's connected with your dreams. Maybe something that you don't remember, but something that you remember. Um, it's all about someone from your past or recent past. I feel like 13, 13 recording time, something that ended way back, maybe. Maybe that's why it's a flip of Six of Cups energy. Do you see this? Maybe. Maybe it's what is going to connect with you in the future, which is which is like you may receive the message, which is someone who is going to come around. This is also possible, possible. As I said, that you may be dealing with someone who is having a heartbreak or breakup, or they are se getting separated for some reason, and the statuses may be different, but something is going to be, like you may get the information or something, and this person is coming around to have or to create harmony. Someone has something to tell you. Like a catch-up may happen suddenly, out of the blue. I feel that kind of energy. This is what they have to say to you. 14, 14 recording time. Page of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Could be Piscean. <clears throat> it's kind of situation which happens after the break. Okay, I also want to mention, I just remembered, that it's going to be double curtain situation to get this like okay there is something that's happening in the back okay behind the scenes but also when the show is on or it's about to get on people are going to watch it it's a double curtain situation that the one curtain is and then people are like i can't see that because there's another curtain it's supposed to be moving again and then something starts the show starts 
and here you go the show starts of the, of the life hey how have you been maybe someone you're dreaming about or have a memory or they're coming in your dreams or something is happening here Someone is going to research in simple words. Some someone is here. Do you see the cards? Okay. They may have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius in their chart. Could be masculine as well. Let's see. What is what is that is not over? With the world card, the return is going to happen. The doors will open. The world. What belongs to you will be coming to you or something that you need to de deal with now or you, it's something that's not over and you need to deal. I feel like it's not closed, like the door is not closed or someone is still feeling that I can connect like, you know. Someone who is looking back, maybe they're looking back at you. Could be King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I feel like, yes, they're looking back at you. Someone is having here craving. As if like it's surrounding around what is that you need to say what is there that's left to say kind of energy it's maybe it's weird I, I cannot tell you it's more it, it's not comfortable okay it's not comfortable I cannot say that oh it's so comfortable no it's not but what depends on like how you deal where you are heading or what they want to say do, are you ready what do you want to uh, continue do you want to continue with this person whatever that is on personal level but all I can say is something is still open between you like it's the door to the past or door to between you both <coughs> oh yes look at it. it's so weird like I'm just I was just taking my own deck and you have two cards which is knight of cups which is here knight of cups and you have the lovers and you have the lovers this is such a synchronicity someone is damn in love with you they want to bounce back to you here possible or someone is just in love with you they want to give you the roses or whatever you wish for there's a message in the envelope and the horse is connected somehow horse is connected as you, as for your life speed or something um, but it's the it's a knight who's ready to tell you this person this person is going to not just act they are it's just about not the pretend zone but they are so they are going to just talk well subtle they want to tell you how much I love they have high dreams they have decided they have decided like they have decided what do you what your decision is different of course <coughs> excuse me <coughs> they have decided okay okay I said you know, the masculine energy has decided something about you. But of course, it's on you as well. If you are a masculine or a feminine, you also have the decision like here mode. And you, are you ready? That's why I talked about like there are two curtains. One curtain, okay, there's. What about you? Are you ready to start the show? Like, you know, the show must go on kind of energy. And... It does depend on what they are going to talk. What is that they are exactly going to talk? Because they are going to exactly talk. We are going to keep these cards. Yes, we are going to. Okay, please wake up. Tables will turn. Someone is coming around to talk to you. Maybe someone from past. Because that's what is in cards. Even if I don't say from the psychic. Because they are saying... They keep telling me it's about dreams as well. I'm having hiccups, missing you. Tables will turn. Someone is going to get in touch with you. They will talk because they're missing you. Their heart is 
you know it's like they feel like you're the other half it's also missing it's also about the discontent zone it's also about someone who is going through heartache or separation or something i feel like they're missing you Uh, about this person about this person who may be masculine or feminine I feel like this was masculine but whatever <clears throat> as per you when they as when they were growing up it was not easy for them okay maybe it's about childhood it was not easy it was struggle around parents or struggle around their own area I know normally it is a struggle you know not everyone's life is easy it's different but it's still full of struggle but sometimes people they have very easy life as well okay because they're lucky or they get they get emotional support most of the time but some don't so i cannot deny this i cannot put that sugar coating and say oh yes they all get no even a child has their own struggle you have lead the way be a leader show others how it's done you can help others maybe someone over here if this is about the person whatever they dealt with whatever they've gone through they experience that they learn that and then they they lead they, they are leading the way I mean they were of help to others like maybe you are also of help someone has seen Someone has seen or dealt with more cryptic life, okay? Um, how well I can explain you. It's also around birds. Maybe they work in there, they are specialized in there, they may be the doctor and they may be helping birds special section. Oh my God. Birds special section is there, okay? Maybe. Um... <clears throat> It's all about words. It's all about the the things they've gone through. To get this, like it's about the life journey. They made friends with people, or they made friends with the energies who were not right for them. But because they needed to set the course, or they needed to go on the journey and continue the life, they made friends with someone who were weird. Okay. But it's also the energy which I want to say, like something, while they were learning this, this is their experience, maybe someone was healing and this was the only way. Maybe it was about nature, about birds and getting involved with that, maybe. If it's not about you, if it's this person, I feel like they did put their energy in a better zone, okay? They have friends around. That's an, another message. They have friends around but nothing or their involvement with energy or dating or something like that or meeting people okay let's just say that it never uh, completed their heart it's always something avoid or something that is not fulfilling them they are not finding the one they found in you no matter how different species or different type of people they have uh, dated you know masculine or feminine and all that it never matches it, it's not it's different it's different with you it's different with you okay um, do I need here I think they're saying that take these cards okay they never found someone like you let's just say that like when we talk we don't wipe so they've never like it's difficult for them to wipe possible Message in envelope. Something is going to happen very soon or soon. Let's see what. You're going to receive the message.
I know people would love to hear tables will turn. Okay. But if something that never worked and something that was disgusting or someone's behavior was pathetic, do you really feel like even if tables turn, would you love to be with such a person? I mean, you know, please take your decisions wisely. Okay. This could be someone's return you knew or someone who is returning and is connecting with you. So soon your patience will pay off and this is the voyage. This is all about emotional voyage and this is all about emotional voyage like return. Okay. This could be new love in your life as well. This could be someone who is presenting themselves because they are in, they're, they're thinking about you and they're too much in love with you and if it's okay and there were genuine reasons kind of this person is having romantic feelings. Someone wants to visit you. Maybe they're going to message you. I want to meet you. Do you? Would you? Someone is sorry as well. Sometimes this does change the course of action. Like, you know, forgiveness. The seeking forgiveness possible from you. I talked about ho horse and all talked about the time for action and horses here. Something that you're going to take the action regarding horse or the speed or the race or something is connected with that. <clears throat> Live in the moment. It's going to. Someone is going to cross paths with you. This could be new. This could be from the past. Someone who wants to, they're interested in talking to you. Twin flame is not ready. They may have reasons to tell you that I was not ready, okay? There are so many reasons coming with this and this is the live in the moment because they will talk to you about, about what I always, I was hiding, okay? But I want to, you know, come back or just let's talk. You're going to connect with someone in simple words Let's see the moral of the story. You be in following your journey, okay? Someone you let go of freely. Someone who was not ready. Someone you just said, okay. Okay, go on your journey. Go on your life, go on with your life. And then there's going to be the moment, the moment when you're going to be having the connection here. You're going to cross paths again. And tables will turn because this person does miss you. Okay, and look, let me sort it out. And this person is all ready to talk to you about their feelings. Now, <clears throat> and it's going to be, do you want to lead this way? Okay, you are caught up. And if this person is even, oh my, I was warm. Even if this person is caught up with people and friends or someone they've dated or they've known, it's, they've felt as if like it's not working. Okay, nothing can fill the void here. So, yes, I feel like this is what is coming. Just give me a second. Now, I feel like you are going to connect with someone from your past. Uh, the person who is going to contact you, they are going to initiate the conversation. They have broken your heart or gave you the disheartened situations and for that they're sorry. They're going to apologize for what they did and they're genuinely coming and picking that, those things and making the effort. The, they want to really open the chapter because for them it's not closed. Way. For, this is something has changed in this story, in your world and in their world, but they are going to make the move to tell you that how much they still feel for you. Like they really want to connect with you. There is someone who's going to definitely tell you that I want to connect with you. What? Okay. Take care and see you soon. Bye-bye.